The debate as to whether St. Lucia should accede to the Caribbean Court of Justice, CCJ, has been a topical issue during the last few months. The government of St. Lucia recently moved a motion to make the CCJ St. Lucia's final appellate court in the lower and upper house of assembly. Recently, a team from the CCJ Accession Committee led by Chairman Sir Dennis Barron visited the community of Sufra to speak to residents with the many advantages leaving the Privy Council and joining the CCJ would have for St. Lucia. The design of the, this program also reflected the court's approach to access to justice, making it easier and more convenient for people to get their cases done in court. And the facilities that, that have been created, I think is, I think they're first class. And we they are available for for courts throughout the region. Um, you know, it, I don't know I, I, everybody's using the internet now in different ways. Residents of Soufre Font Saint Jacques relished the opportunity to get all their burning questions answered. A lot of our laws are okay. How are we going to or what is this <coughs> The, the legislative well, well, body, what are they doing to try and improve? Well, I, I the think that, that when I think, I have to make the point that a lot of the illegal weaknesses that we have described are from laws that were inherited mm -hmm. under the colonial system. Member of Parliament for Soufre Fonse Jacques, Emma Hippolyte, explains that such consultation on a community level is very important as it will help the ordinary man understand what is being done on a policy level. She applauded the committee for making a stop in Soufre and noted that the benefits to be gained from St. Lucia's move to the CCJ will directly impact her constituents. So the CCJ is a very bold step by our government where we are trying to bring justice, making the average person um, gain access to justice and if that is so then we need to ensure that the average man understands why we are moving from the Privy Council to the Caribbean Court of Justice and not only why what are, what are the benefits what are the benefits for the average person because as you walk around you'll hear some people clamoring for justice and that justice must be accessible and for it to be accessible it must be affordable and that is what the CCJ bring to the table. Once the bill is successfully passed in the House of Assembly, St. Lucia will be the fifth CARICOM country to accede to the Caribbean Court of Justice. From Sufra FM, I am Genevieve Gonzague.